everybody crafting my more paper crafts here right it's that time of the month and it is smash your stash so uh, this goes up on the 15th of every month and it's a collab that is organized by Deb Hauk and all her details will be in the description below um, along with the other collaborations the other people that take part and um, as you can probably see I hate to mention it but I've done some of the dreaded C crafting <laughs> the dreaded C word crafting so I've done some Christmas cards and what I've used is this book um, I got it from a Facebook uh, seller and I can't for the life of me think what her name is. I really can't remember. I had a few, I've got a few of these at the beginning of the year. And I hadn't used them. I think they are all kind of Christmassy themed. So I thought, oh, I'll use one of those up and I'll get started on my Christmas cards. So I've used it all up. Um, there's a couple of words that I've not used, but I absolutely detest the word Xmas it's just one of those words I do not like um, I just want it to be Christmas have a happy Christmas this is just my preference I just hate Xmas the word Xmas I just think it no it's just not it so I've used that so I've uh, not used the Xmas words <laughs> And um, and then on the back, these are the cards that you can make. So I've made 12. I mean, I have done them as it says on here, apart from leaving some of the words out, as I've just said. So I'll get on and show you what I've done. So there were different sizes. So we'd got the... Um, the measurements on there are the square ones are 13 by 13. Not sure what that is in real money. Um, but I think these might be five by fives. But we have lovely reindeer. And this, I haven't done anything else except put the card together. The glittery elements and the like clear embossed elements were already done in the kit. Um, it was all die cut, so you just had to um, push it out of the book. Um, I did trim some of the edges up because you get the little tabs, don't you, on the sides. And um, yeah, just decorated it, decorated it up. I just realised that I put that star on there and covered up Mary. Let me just, I'll, I'll put that under there like that, that's better. Yeah, so quite pleased with that. And then we've got this clock one. Christmas countdown. Again, all the glittery bits were already there. So you've got like these little um, flags with the stars on and the little berries. That look Well, it looks like a jingle bell actually because it's got the four slots in there. And we've got Mr. Foxy. So we've got Let It Snow, and this is like in a black um, heat embossed uh, writing. Really nice pads, they really are. And to get some quick makes, I've done these in probably a couple of hours. I put some of them on uh, dimensionals just to lift them up a little bit. Again, this is like the heat embossed effect. The um, Christmas trees all have like a glitter heat embossed effect. Really gorgeous. And we have a bear. So then these are, um, these bits are 10 by 15. This is... I think it might be a six by four card. So I have a bear. He's outside the window of the cottage or the hut. 
So that's lovely, isn't it? So you've got like paper snowdrops and you've got all the log rolls there. And then we've got a nice cosy fireplace. Again, look, that is heat embossed with a bit of sparkle in it. I'm really pleased with them. Oh, and inside, on each page, there was like a mini version of the whole picture. So in each card, I put the mini version on the inside. As you'll see, I forgot to show you that bit. And I thought, oh, that just makes it, finishes it off quite nicely, doesn't it? A bit like cards that you buy. They often have a, an additional picture inside. I'm not taking that bit off. Pull that bit off, that's better. The clock and our reindeer. So yes, so that's those, showing you those again. So that was the fireplace. So then we've got another uh, reindeer. No, that's a moose, isn't it? A caribou moose. So again, I've just... Um, taken the die cuts out and um, arranged them all. That's the picture inside. So this looks like it's on string just coming in on the uh, page. And we have this chalkboard one, Merry Christmas. And then these are the names of all the um, reindeer, Santa's reindeer. Dasher, Dancer, What does that say? Prancer, <laughs> gosh. <laughs> Vixen, Comet, Cupid. That says Dammer. That's um, Rudolph. I'm not sure about those two names. But again, you've got the sparkly log. And the picture on the inside. These were two flags that you stick on. And then we've got this gorgeous one with the glittery window, like a frosty window outside. And we've got Santa and his reindeer. This one should have had an Xmas on it and I, I chose not to put it on. As you can see look, on the little picture it's got Xmas on. I, I had to live with that one. <laughs> And then on here we've got another window. A little squirrel. See that says Xmas, but it was already on the embossed onto the picture. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Merry Christmas. North Pole handmade, beautiful. And there we are again. And then last but not least, Starry Night. I think there was an Xmas goes on this one, but I chose not to put it on. So we've got our squirrel again. Lovely hearts, and this is like the the Christmas card that gets put on a lot of uh, pictures. And yeah, look, Xmas on a Bulldog clip, so I chose not to put that one on. So it, yeah, lovely. I've really enjoyed using this pad, and um, as I say, I've used them all, and I've managed to make 12 Christmas cards today, so that's really good. I have got the envelopes that go with it. As I showed you, this is the pad that I've used, so um, yeah, I'm really pleased with that. And it says, look, no scissors required. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope you've enjoyed looking at the cards that I've made. That's my um, my collab for this month. I've really enjoyed it. I've not had to rush to do it. I've got um, a week in hand. And um, yeah, I will uh, put it on ready to uh, to be put on live at um, on the 15th which is what day are we today 6th and 8th next Sunday next Sunday 
So you'll be seeing this on the 15th and I've made them all on the 8th. So thank you so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed to me, I would love, love, love you to subscribe to me. And um, I will see you all again very soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.